The first sip is always just foam. Yum. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, today's video, I wanted to um, show you one of my favorite staple pieces for fall, which is the blazer. And the blazer has changed over the year. The style used to be very fitted and a little cropped. Well, actually, then we went to cropped, and now we're kind of at this, like, dad blazer, or the granddad blazer, you know, with a little shoulder pad, very structured, very tailored, but a little oversized at the same time. That's just kind of what I'm loving right now, as you'll see in the lookbook portion. But I wanted to show you guys five ways to wear blazers, as well as partner up with Majuri to show you uh, my favorite everyday jewelry. And you guys know I've been a fan of Majuri for over a year now. There are pieces that I literally just do not take off. Since it is almost Black Friday, and I'm sure you are gearing up to shop for your mom, sister, best friend, their Black Friday sale is, it ends on the 30th, but it's live right now, uh, in Cyber Monday, which is the 30th, um, and they're doing 10% off one item, 15% off two items, and then 20% uh, off of three or more items. So, a really good deal. But I will show you my everyday pieces. I know I did this on Instagram a while ago, but I thought I would do it on here because I haven't yet, and I do get questions about my jewelry. So I'll show you first what I wear every single day that I don't take off, and then I'll show you what I'm wearing in the lookbook in addition. So my pieces that I don't take off are these two rings right here. So this small one is called the Thin Band and it is 14 karat gold. And then this one right here is the Bold Stacker. <laughs> Sorry, just choked a little bit. It's also 14 karat gold, but I like to wear these pieces stacked on top of each other. I love the masculine um, vibe of this bottom one, the thick one, and then I love like the feminine of this one right here. My other everyday ring is this little beaded guy right here. It's called the beaded ring, and it's also 14 karat gold. On this finger, I always wear the croissant dome. This is gold vermeil. These are my like go-to small gold um, earrings, and they're the croissant dome earrings. Then my other ring, which is probably my favorite out of all of them, is the Charlotte ring, and I love it so much that I actually got two because I love the look of them stacked on top of each other. But obviously, you could just wear one, and it's still quite a bit of a statement. I actually got the idea for doing this on their Instagram. They posted someone who was wearing them double um, stacked and I thought it was so cool so I got a second one. If you were going to do a gift for anybody, honestly, I think the Charlotte ring is so perfect. I think it's like enough of a statement for a gift um, but also kind of fits anybody's style at the same time. Then my everyday necklaces, I pretty much wear all three of these every day. I do take the herringbone one off um, when I'm like showering and stuff. I just I don't know, it's my newer one, so I'm a little bit more careful with it. The herringbone is gold vermeil, and then I also have the herringbone silver bracelet that I wear every day. Then for my necklaces, I have the curb chain, which is this gold one right here, and then the baby box necklace, which is a very small, delicate, thin chain. Sometimes I, I'll put like my vintage lockets on the baby box chain. It's uh, kind of a good multi-use chain. The beaded hoops in the 14 karat white gold. Um, I just love the texture of the croissant dome um, earrings and the beaded hoops together. And then for my other two everyday bracelets, these two right here, I've got the bold link chain bracelet and then the curb chain bracelet. Let's see if I can get a close up of those. And then two other pieces that you'll see in the video that I don't normally wear every single day are two necklaces. So I've got the bold chain. Here this adds length so when you are layering necklaces I think adding that length is good if you want just like one more layer. Um, if you want something a little bit more you know that stands out that's not so delicate I think this is a good option. And then one that I'm actually getting so much use of that I actually didn't think I would. I thought I would wear it on occasion but not as much as I actually do. Is this a double oval link chain necklace. It is so cool. I have been wearing a lot more silver lately um, just because in the fall winter I do so much like gray and navy and I think silver is a great addition to that color family. So I've been trying to grow my silver collection and I think this one is just so cool. But you'll see me wear this in the lookbook. All right, that is all the jewelry I wanna show you for now. I do have a Majuri link down below where you can click on it and I think you'll see everything on one page that I, not only that I'm wearing now, but that I own. Um, Cause I do have some Majuri pieces that I didn't show in this video that are older. Um, just because I couldn't wear all my <laughs> jewelry for one like lookbook. I will put all of the Black Friday promotion down below as well. 
it ends the 30th, it's Cyber Monday, don't forget. But I'm gonna let you guys get into the lookbook and I'll see you next time, bye.